Alright, hey everybody. So this video I'm just basically making about like about like everything that's going on in the world right now. I mean, this is the first time that I'm pretty sure any of us had to go through a pandemic like this. Um, and it's not it's not fun, you know, especially for people who really do care about others in the world. Like it is very, very sad what's going on with this virus and it's very, very bad in America, but it's not just in America. It's like a virus that was global and it it's a very dangerous virus that people are taking lightly. I believe that you need to be super careful and be wearing your mask so you can not only protect yourself, you can protect yourself, your family, and everyone else out there because if you're contaminated and you do not know and you do not wear that mask, you are just getting people contaminated and more sick that you're around when you go shopping. Um, I really do miss the normal living of life, of going to the stores, being able to go anywhere and do anything, hang out with friends, and it's not like that anymore. So it makes you really appreciate the little thing that we take for, we take like for advantage for, and we're just so used to that routine and schedule, we never really think about, hey, wow, this is what life could be like without having that. And then things just keep getting worse, you know, it's like 2020 is just wanting to make a joke out of all of us, and I really am not liking it, so I'm hoping that it can get better for the whole world's sake. I have noticed that the environment of the actual world itself, like the nature aspect, and like the seas, and the greenery, everything has gotten better since the virus happened because everybody is indoors and they're not outside like smoking and using their vehicles and doing all th these things that are making a bad impact on the world itself but I mean I just really wish the world could go back to the way it was before I hope it could and I really hope that this virus will not mutate and come back like all these medical professionals are saying will because I'm really sick of it I don't like people getting sick and dying. I like there to be a cure and for there to be help and with this it's hard to. And really I really think people need to start taking this virus more seriously. It's not a joke. And like everything else just keeps getting worse. Now there's rioting and everything going on and it's just I'm really hoping that all these rioting will make a good change in the world for once because for the first time ever so many states and so many countries and places started doing the riots and for a good cause. I I really hope that it, that it like I just really hope that this world could become a better place for everybody in every single aspect from health to having peace to having justice to having to having their career back uh, everybody's losing their jobs and it's just honestly it's just very very sad and I'm not I'm not super happy about it but what could you do you can't do anything besides continue to be happy and make the best out of everything that you can like right now being in quarantine since March we're all okay at home we're all being funny together making jokes watching movies playing games making videos, laughing at stuff, watching videos. There's ways that you can still interact and appreciate things that you're still blessed with, even though we've gotten taken away the privilege of going outside and living normally again for a little bit. So I just want to make this video so you guys can see kind of how I felt about all of this. And because I wanted to see kind of how you guys feel, if you can let me know in the comments too, because... I mean, I am, I'm on the side to always have, because I'm a kind hard person, to always have peace and justice and everybody to be treated equally, so I really am more on that side of this aspect of writing in the Black Lives Matter movement going on. Um, and just because I'm a kind hard person, I think everyone needs to be treated equally, and with this virus... I really hope that people could stop getting sick. I have I know people who have gotten sick um, and places had to shut down because of it. People are dying because of it. People have also recovered because of it. So I just, 
I just really wanted to put myself out there and let you guys know how I felt about all of this and to make a little video so later on in life when we are through with all of this and we've moved forward, I can always look back and be like, this is what happened during this time. I even started journaling about things that are occurring in the world because so much is occurring. And the funniest thing is The Simpsons literally predicts it all when you go back and watch them. I haven't, but I've seen all those memes and like, oh my god, look at this, they predicted this. And I was like, wow, that's true. I'm just hoping nothing else happens though in 2020 and really it can just start going uphill from here because we're midway 2020 and it's just still pretty crucial. I mean, like I saw this video and literally like people think that it's just going to keep getting worse and it's sad. Like, I mean... I just hope that the world could become a better place for people. That's all that I've ever wanted is world peace. And for there to be cures for all these health illnesses. So, yeah, that's where I stand with all of this. I just want to make a quick little video and let you guys know to please take this virus seriously. Please protect yourselves and stay safe. Um, and please try to stay safe during this whole movement of the riots and stuff because it it's just... You need to be safe in the world in general, and now you really need to think extra before you do something. You can you can harm yourself, someone else, and your family by doing one stupid little selfish act. So please, everybody, stay safe. Um, stay healthy. Please let me know how you guys feel about everything that's going on in 2020. Comment down below, share this video, and subscribe. Thanks, guys, so much.